Hi there folks, this is me and Miss Enemy Raven. Today I would like to tell you of the the things a video about well, you know, I know it's kinda you know, you know me. I like to talk about what I am and what I do things around here. First of all, the first thing is I am a nineties kid. Yeah. I was born on March nineteenth, nineteen ninety. Yeah. I was actually born right after um the rescue rain the rescuers down under movie. So yeah, that movie was awesome. The very first Disney Princess that I ever watched was Beauty and the Beast. You know I love Belle, right? You know I'm a book reader. I copied everything. I even copied her hairstyle. I have long, dark chocolate brown hair, just like her. I even dressed up as her for Halloween. You probably saw my Halloween videos from last year, probably. And next year I'll be dressing up as her in a yellow dress because I have a dress that looks just like hers. Anyway, to tell you about also my favorite characters from Disney. First of all, favorite Disney villains, only three: Call the Snake, because he was voiced by Winnie the Pooh, and of course Shere Khan, because well, tigers are my favorite animal. Tigers are my favorite animal from India, and of course Maleficent, because well, she's an awesome dark fairy. I mean, come on. In most of my stories at New 66, I do a fan series about her being, well, having a daughter that's the daughter of Hades. So if you want to read my stories, go to New 66 and read The Daughter of Hades. It's a good story. My writing's not really good, but give it a try. It has a style. And let's see, um, hmm. That's all, really. Well, for villains, at least. The characters I like from Snow White? Well, not really. To tell you the truth, I'm not really a Snow White fan, or... I like a little bit of Ariel, Jasmine, this is his favorite, Mulan, Pocahontas, to tell you the truth, I like the new ones, you know, from the new era. Like, as I said, there's Megara too, and Jane is, eh. Tiana is awesome, and, well, Tango, well, I'm not really into her, but me and my sister are big fans of Frozen. My sister is, well, like Elsa, always working hard to help, and she's sometimes a little nerd. My sister's a boyfriend. He's very nice. And me, I'm like Anna, because, hello, very energetic. <laughs> and, yeah. Anyway, also, I've been collecting many books. I've been trying to create uh, a library. Here. All my books. Today, I collect a collection of, oh, William Joyce books. You know, the Guardian series. You know, about Santa, Truth Fairy, Sandman, and of course, these different. But they haven't exactly created a book about how the Nightmare Guy became who he is. You know who I mean. Piss. Okay, back to the obvious. My favorite color is red, as you can see, because, well, I wear red. And, <coughs> I do love to read books. My favorite book from the collection of well, most of the movies we all watch are based on books. My favorite books to read would be like, um, Jungle Book, Coraline, Beauty and the Beast, of course, and, um, let's see, um, hmm. there are all kinds of other books. But my favorite ones, my favorite choice is Matilda, because hello, he is an awesome. And there's the BFG, and also I have the last unicorn book, yeah. Took me a while to find that one. I'm actually trying to find a lot of good books, ghost stories, all kinds of stories. My favorite um, horror book is, well, to tell you the truth, it's hard to tell, really. The only one that actually gave me the scares was, well, hmm, The Phantom of the Opera. It's the only scary book that doesn't scare me because, well, as you know from my other videos, I have ghosts in my apartment. So basically, I'm all afraid of ghosts. Witches? Pfft. I've researched witches since I was a kid. Right after I started learning arena at 12, the first book I read was uh, um, the, the Witch and the Wardrobe and the Lion. The first page I read, my mom went into the kitchen. I was like 12. And I, and I read the first page, the page of the little ghost being sad for the lion. Then I ran into saying, Mommy, Mommy, I can read. And after that, I started reading every single book on weird stuff. As you may have noticed, I also have books on monsters and all sorts, so I'm a cryptology. That means I study about monsters, like, my favorite top 
three is Nessie, Bigfoot, and Mothman. Those are my three tops. The ones that I don't like and kind of scared of is the Oklahoma octopus. As you know, there is a freshwater octopus tr um, struck in the uh, big lake under the red bridge of Oklahoma Lake. Many people gone there and did that. Also, another beast that I would be afraid of is the giant death form that lives in the desert. If you saw Lost Tapes, yeah, they scared me. That's the only thing that scares me. I don't like horror movies. The only movie that I'm not afraid of is the, well, it's, you might not have liked it. It was made back in 1991. It's a um, rem remake of the, uh, um, the Haunted, if you know that one. That movie was reviewed by, uh, by uh, uh, you know, how um, the soundtrack made fun of it. The CGI and all that. You probably know what I'm talking about. The Haunted remake, yeah. Well, it's funny to me. It's the only movie I'm not afraid of. But I'm going to try to conquer my fear of horror movies. The first movie I'm going to watch, try to watch, is Crimson Peak. Because, well, to tell you the truth, I'm not into love stories, but i got to try to give up my fears. I've given up a few fears of them. Anyway, I'll be age 26 this year, and, well, for my birthday, I'm just planning to do, like, go to Universal with my sister and a boyfriend. I'm saving up my money. I just did my, I done my last bit of book shopping, so now I will be reading till July. Yes, I have tons of books to read, a thousand books to read now. Okay, as you know, all me. Oh, like, now, I'm on a diet. I have been trying to lose weight, and do I look like I lost weight? Do I look like I lost weight? Please tell me I do. I work really hard. It's not easy losing weight. I had given up eating my favorite snack. My favorite junk food is cheese popcorn. You know, the cheddar cheese popcorn in those bag, big black bags. And it's been a couple of months since I had it, but for a Super Bowl, I had a lot. So now I'm... And also, my sister said to send me some um, Valentine's Day treats. Yeah, you know, how it is. So now after Valentine's Day, over, you know, tomorrow. Tomorrow, yeah. So that means I'll be back on my diet. My favorite... Favorite snacks are, uh, let's see, soy sticks with peanut butter, Lunchables, a green apple, red grapes, but once in a while I would make a homemade juice. I make all the drinks. The only juices I don't like together is watermelon, uh, the green melon, orange melon, and uh, mangoes. Mangoes are tasty, but when you cut them, you gotta make sure of the, the big seed. But I like strawberry, cherry, no bananas. Apple, grape, and of course, cherry. if you mix cherry, strawberry, and uh, grape together, sweet! Also, I do not like soda. I never drink soda. I only drink water, lactose milk, and apple juice once in a while, if there's a party. I do drink alcohol. One drink. I don't smoke. I only drink, um... Strawberry daiquiri. I'm sure you know about it. But the one with, uh, well, you know, once a year, once a month, once a holiday. But that's all. I don't smoke. I don't drink all that beer and all that junk. Ugh. And as you know, I am a toy maker. I make tons of dolls. And so far, I'm still making them. But I want to donate them to charity. So my friend Debbie is bringing them over. And this is Raven. You know her. She's my mascot. And, well, yes. Also, I have to let you know, I do review movies, but I, but I kind of, well, I, I have a hold of, but I have been doing my, I, my Little Pony headcanon videos, but I'm trying to decipher, but I think I've decided that maybe, well, I'm not going to create my pony OC, because, well, it's an alicorn, and, well, I heard an alicorn are kind of not good, so, my OC, for my pony reviews will be None other than Raven. Who I expect? She's my OC. And I made her when I was about 11 years old. She's 15 years old. Yeah, as I said in the past videos, she's 17. But I got the numbers mixed up. She's 15 years old. And yes, her birthday is the same. November 15th. Uh, I gotta try to calculate. But she was born on 15th. So I do know November 15th. Anyway. So, Raven will be my OC, but to tell you the truth, I don't have, like, you know, all those famous reviewers, like, from my little ponies, like, um, um, 
Silver Quill or um, Mr. Wolf, I mean Dr. Wolf and all those others. I really don't have that much money to make an anime character of my raven. I'm pretty much dead on that. And well, I will eventually try to find a good paint program. And all I have for paint program is paint. The normal program that all kids play with. So I'm still trying to figure that out. So for now on, for my OC, it'll be Raven Carry G. Should be my OC for my reviews for everything. But I will not make anime reviews, you know, because, well, all I want to do is just be human for my pony little, you know, headquarters and stories I have given you. Like the uh, last one about Trixie being the great, 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 great granddaughter of Star Wars Village. Alright, back to what I was saying right there. I do like to wear a lot of red dresses. This is one of my favorite ones. And, uh, my sister's doing good at her job. And mom's doing fine. Dad's doing good. I was hoping. My favorite candy in the whole world is Reese's. I can't eat taffy anymore because my teeth. Now, believe me, there's a funny story. For Halloween, we made homemade caramel apples. And I accidentally lost my crown in one of my caramel apples. I had to go to the dentist. But do you know if that didn't happen? I would have made a, a bug ten. You see... I sold a doll to one of the uh, dent one of the nurses at the dentist clinic, and she paid me moolah. So yeah, me thinking, yeah, could do that. But I'm also thinking that I don't need my toy stereo. Although now the only candy I do like to eat once in a while is Reese's, but I do like to eat the none eat them, but you know, like lollipops. These were my favorite when I was a little girl. They still sell them. I found them at Five Below Shop here in Florida, Jacksonville. And, it's, and I have a three-wheeled new bicycle I got for Christmas. And it's been lasting really well. I've been riding, getting a lot of exercise, riding all over the park, all over the places. I also love to eat, I mean, to Hubba Bubba Max. A whole new kind of bubble! You know, remember that gum? It's still here. My favorite is, cheer. my favorite is, well, strawberry flavored bubble gum. Hubba Bubba Max. You know what I mean. <laughs> I'm sure all of you have seen it before. Anyway, for Valentine's Day, I've given everyone their gifts. But we're going to do it uh, tomorrow. We'll do it tomorrow. Anyway. <laughs> I tend to read a lot of books on the cryptology. And, and also, I'm a big when it comes to ghosts. Sorry, I'm all jittery. Cody's been a very good boy. But he's been, uh, like, you know, moving my pillows a lot. You know how that boy is. Anyway. Back to the things. But I, I do eat tons of vegetables. I make myself vegetable soup. Lunch of bowls. But once a month I do a steak sandwich. Thing. Just steak and ketchup and bread. But once a month when we have steak. But I don't eat hamburgers or McDonald's anymore. I just eat a uh, salad or a breakfast or a McMuffin. You know. McMuffin is a breakfast sandwich with a muffin bread. You know what I mean. You know what a McMuffin is. Of course, you know what it is. So, yeah. But my favorite restaurants to go to are Denny's, because that's the best breakfast foods and dinners. <laughs> Wendy's. Better salads. Plus, that's the best strawberry grilled chicken salad with spinach leaves and all that. Then there's McDonald's once in a while. Then there's um, hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, chicken, oh yeah, chicken filet, my favorite chicken restaurant. I like my, uh oh, my mom's calling me. I gotta run, guys. See ya. Adios, amigos. Bye, bye.